This is the Father's Day fish. Me and the kids just pulled up at the beach. We're just about to have some dinner. And then um, we're going to do a bit of night fishing. Beautiful little spot we've pulled up at. Just, uh, we're just about to have our dinner. Unreal. How's the serenity? Whoa. I'll anchor up. I've got a little spot there I've found anchor on it tonight and hopefully get a fish out of it. We're going to fish in the morning too, so we'll get some flatties and that in the morning for Father's Day and I'll take a moment and smoke them. This is me set up. She's a beauty. Don't know what you buggers are doing, but... <laughs> Where are they? There's a few there. Just having a little look around. We're high tide now, so... They're up on the boat rim having a bit of a poke around. Beautiful. They're flat tail mullet too, so. Good to see them up here, that's a good sign. Ready, Pen? See that? <laughs> Got him. He doesn't know he's hooked yet. Oh, pulled him out of his mouth. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Get him back down there with a big fish. Oh, he pulled out of his mouth. Just down here, I just pulled one out of its mouth, I burlied up, got a bit excited for my first fish of the night and pulled it out of his gob and skewing. I've had two hits now. Hopefully I get one, I'll burly up a bit more and try and try and get one in. There should be some here if I look at it. Good sign anyway. Oh, I think it might be a Neil, but we'll... Come down here, buddy. Come over here. Stand up there, stand up there now. Well, you just get me that. Okay. Grab the rod, mate. Bend in line. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, good one. Oh, good one. Oh, yeah, here he is. Yeah. It's fighting alright, I don't know what it is. It's a bee. Let's go check to season three. Oh, oh, I just doesn't know his hooks still, is he? You lost him, did you? Wind a bit quicker. Wind quicker. Oh. It's a little stingray. No. Oh. It was a stingray. It was no, really Look, wait. I hope that's not what we're getting. Right, it's about 3.30 in the morning. I've pulled up. I've got a, got a spot. I'm on, I'm on Gunya Beach, so I'm just going to... Just off Gunya Beach, there's a big gully that runs through. Uh, yeah, it's 3.30. The tide's at 4.30, but because there's so much fresh up the top of the river, it's going to push down and probably push for another hour so I'm hoping what's going to happen is because that body of fresh water is so so more it's going to push down for yeah say an hour and then that'll make the tide the change of the tide right on sunrise so I've got a heap of baits out I've got four rods out I've got two two squid and two butterfly yellowtail so I'm just going to 
see how I go, a couple of yakkers out. And I just don't know what they're feeding on, so I'll just, I thought I'd just have a bit of a try, put the squid and the yellow and the yakkers out, and whatever goes, and then I'll change and put the four. If I get one, and then I'll just change, change me bait to, to whatever that gets taken. So hopefully I'll get one now, I'll just kick back and let the sun rise and enjoy it. If I don't get one, I'll just, I'll love it anyway, don't worry, no, it doesn't worry me. And then once the sun comes up and, and the tide changes, I'll swing around. Then I'll fish another hour of the run up to it till the water picks right up and pushes too hard. I'll move again because they won't stay here when the water's pushing real hard. And I'll move and I might just try and get a feed of flatty for, for Father's Day and I'll go home and cook them up and sit around and eat them. She's a bit fresh too, don't worry about that. It's fresh around the ears. We've got the kids down here, they're asleep in the swag. So I've been down here all night, fished one spot, but bloody all I've done is got stingrays there, and I've I've set the alarm and I've got up and moved moved out here. So let's see how it goes. Hopefully I'll get one here. It'd be good. It'd be nice. Even just a bite, just so I know that they're where they are. I did mark a couple. So I, when I come through, I sounded sounded up and I and I did mark a few arcs coming through so hopefully I can bring one close to the boat and take one of my little baits I've got out here kick back and watch the sunrise get a feet I'll wake these kids up and they can watch the sun come up over the up over Lion Island I'm set right up so I can actually view Lion Island so the sun will come up and they can watch the sun come up over Lion Island and out to the sea, it's going to be a beauty. I'll try and film a bit of it too. I might turn the camera around so it faces that way. All right, I'll leave it with you. I'll go back and have a bit of a lie down and wait for this. Hopefully one of these um, rods gets smoked. sort of ground we're looking for. Look at this. This is prime dewfish spot. I'll just keep zapping a while here. I'll just turn this up a bit. Now that's a drop. So I'm going to sit up the top now. Have two baits sitting up the top here. Hold on. I'm going to sit up here, I'm going to put two baits down in here and I'm going to sit two baits back up on the shallow there. We're just going to fish the top of this tide which is another hour. <laughs> you made me pull back. <laughs> right, we've fished pretty hard. Well, this is our last little spot before we go home. The tide's running in, we're just going to fish till top of this tide and then we'll, we'll head off. There's not much around, it's still a bit cold I think and there's a heap of fresh in the water so that's what I'm blaming anyway. But this is our last spot, we're just going to fish this, the tide's probably got another hour left in it or hour and a half I think, to the top of the tide and once it slows and starts to change we'll pack up and move, we'll go home, <laughs> call it a day. Right, we're packing up, we're going home. It was a good little adventure anyway, having a look around. The kids had a, the kids had a ball. They've just about had enough, so we're heading off now. Little tour of the joint. It was a good little weekend. Just waiting for the fish to come on, so we were just basically trying to catch a fish, but getting some spots at the same time. We marked a heap of spots ready for the summer months when the when the fish are here, so we're pretty happy. <laughs>